Hi traders, short recap of my trading session today. Take a look at the Nasdaq, it's down 2%, it's a huge gap down. Normally when you have such a big gap down, it is more likely that the market, the S&P 500 and the Nasdaq will move higher. So you look for a reversal. Once you see the first sign of reversal and look at this bottoming tail and the green candle that is about to be built up, you look for a long and I found it in Nvidia. That's why I'm going to go long and buy 2000 shares of Nvidia right over here. So it just spiked up, I bought 2000 shares the market starting to move higher and again expect it once you get the market in with starting with a very big gap down expect it to bounce back up not all the way it will bounce up up to a point where it will stop and normally will come down again now it's a nice technical reversal here so I'm about to add another 1000 shares here just added now I'm long 3000 shares again you do not add to a losing trade you add to a winner it's trending higher you add now it's going sideways as you can see it still is moving higher because the market still moving higher and at that point it's spiking over the highs and I'm about to take my partial and right now I sold 2700 shares and left just 300 shares so this turned out to be the right thing to do based on the direction of the Nasdaq and the S&P 500 and again look at the way we moved up a big gap down normally creates a pressure to move higher that's what happened I was looking for a long it's not the only one that I took for a long today I had uh, another long in TTWO it's the same idea exactly the same idea another winner Baba was actually short but Baba was an early trade once the market started initially to move down but anyway I'm starting my day with three green trades and over $7,600 in profit in really just less than 30 minutes or so so just remember this when you have the market starting with a huge gap down you expect it to move higher you do not expect it to close the gap but you expect an upside pressure so the best idea is to look for a long a stock that is not too weak that is consolidating near the lows and looks to you as if it's likely to move higher and in the case of TTWO the stock was up it started up by 4% some good news in TTWO so find another nice technical formation and go long so it's more likely the market will move higher and then at some point of the day you look for the market to fail moving higher and then come down and if you ask yourself who's buying when the market is down two percent well there's a lot of people who are bottom fishing uh, a lot of people who are averaging down their losses for whatever reason it is a wrong decision they don't normally enjoy that too long they normally lose you're not supposed to do that but they will do it and they will hold on for the stocks that they bought cheap for a long time until normally the market will continue coming down again now remember it does not matter if the market is down 10 or 20 percent or the stock that you're buying is down 30 percent you can still lose 100 percent whatever you buy so be careful don't do it and if you are a day trader you can use the upside move intraday upside move in order to gain as long as you move out rather quickly I thank you for watching this video if you like this video please give us a like it will help our channel and probably more people like you enjoy day trading videos we will appreciate that and uh, please don't forget trading is extremely hard extremely risky what you're seeing here is really untypical I'm a very experienced trader I could make money when other people are losing money so be careful it is very untypical and uh, just don't lose more money than you could afford to lose be very careful while you trade start trading a demo account there's plenty of links right here below one of them to the Colmex platform which I'm using right now which you can start as a demo trader without paying anything so again thank you for watching this video you can subscribe to it right over here and we appreciate the fact that you took the time to watch it thank you I'll see you tomorrow